Definitely got a kick to it. <laughs> you might take it yourself. TQS bonnets, TT. QS bonnets, the bonnets that hold magic. All in and now, introducing a new arrivals available in all ranges and sizes only at tqfbooth.com. Get yours at www.tqfbooth.com. Hi guys, welcome back to the Quiz Family channel. Today I have a friend of mine called John. Hi everybody. <laughs> <laughs> so John, this is the first time of this in Africa for this day. Definitely. Uh, I'll tell you, I've never seen anything like this. It's, it's completely different to what I'm used to. Yeah, yeah. It's just like a thing. Yeah, definitely, yeah, yeah. So today we have jollof rice. It's a bit spicy. And we have a, a goosey soup. We call it a goosey soup. Can you pronounce okay. it? Goosey? No, kukuku. A goosey. A goosey. Yeah, that's yes, goosey soup. Good. That's a goosey soup, goat meat, and uh, we have fufu. We call it fufu. Okay. Can you pronounce it, please? Fufu? Yeah. Okay. Right. Do you have ever eaten Africa food? I don't one bit? No, I do not feel like I have But you can pronounce it. Yeah. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> but so it's a food, say food food. Yeah, food food. 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 Yeah, a goosey soup, then the jello fries. So, how it works is like, we're going to take this. Okay. Food food. Then you see the way I'm going to mold it. Then I put it in the, in the soup. Then I, I put it on my mouth. I start eating. Okay. So, so it, where is the food food? This is the food food. Where is it? It's, uh, it's made of a, uh, yeah, it's like potato. Flour, but it's called nyam flour. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Then we have a uh, goat meat. This is the first time eating goat meat. I've had it once before, a long time ago. Oh, once? Long time ago. once. So this is yeah. going to be the second time? Second time. I oh. Was long time. <laughs> <laughs> At the end of the video, actually, you're going to read the food, the one you like best. It's going to be 100% or 10, 10 over 10 or 20 over 10. Honest opinion? Yeah, yeah, honest. Yeah. You're going to be honest. Yeah. In it. this game, you have to be honest. You need to be honest. If you don't like it, you don't like it, okay? Okay, no problem. So guys, before we start this video, we're going to pray. Uh, this is John. It's the first time of eating Nigerian food. For me, this is not my first time. I was born with this. You get what I'm saying? So yeah. like that, let's pray. Yeah, it's definitely not pizza and chips. <laughs> <laughs> In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, we thank you. Bless your holy name. We thank you, Lord, for this wonderful day, Lord. Thank you for this food, Lord. We're going to eat and pray for those that are watching me. Lord, I pray, O Lord, may your name be glorified in their life and raise them, O Lord, in any problem that they are facing. Lord, I cover this, O Lord, with the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. So, John, which one do you want to go first? The one you want to try first? How are we going to eat this? Are we going to take in the, the dough and I'm dipping it in a bit of everything? Or? No. Don't start. Let's have some goosey. Mm -hmm. And is it jello for rice? Jello for rice? Yeah, this is jello fries. Jello fries. This is a goosey and this is fufu. Okay, with the goosey and fufu. So, you will take one of these, you hold it. Then, this is my one. It's hard, is it? Then, um, you see the way I'm going to hook on it. You go down here. You smack it, bro. I slap the fufu, no mercy. Hey, yeah. smart. <laughs> <laughs> so, you, you, you take it off, gently. Gently, yeah. You take it off ah, like this. Yeah. yeah. You take it off. Wow. Done. I see. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, it? Yeah. yeah. No. Okay. Uh, That's good, man. <laughs> you gonna put the soup here? Okay. Take your choice. Uh, each side we have a good meat too. Okay. Yeah. Take your choice, man. So is that like an oil, or is it, or is it like yeah. a? Uh, uh, oh yeah, you oh yeah. So, like you can you can take us one. I'm sorry to be cautious. It's when this is my first time. All right. See, this is where I dish my one. You know. Is it still got the bones in it as well? Is that does the meat in this one still got bones in it? As well? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Guys, this is my food, and this is junk food. You see. So, John, let's start. Okay. So you're gonna cut it, no? Yeah, this this, this, this is pole. size. This is size. Then you're gonna you're gonna mold it. Don't use a two hand. 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 Then you put it you put it in here. Come on. Wow, wow. Like that? Yeah. Then <laughs> is it lovely? It's lovely. It's definitely got a kick to it. I think, I think it was too big. I think I had yeah, too much, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah for food. Yeah, for food. <laughs> yeah. Food was too much. Oh, no, much. by the end of the thing. Yeah, definitely had too much of food. Yeah, yeah you had to take a deep This is more. definitely like a, like a mashed potato. A mashed potato does it. With a bit of starch. It's lovely though. It's really yeah. nice. Really nice, it? I told you, I said, when you take this food, believe me, even if you are sleeping, you're going to be dreaming about this food. This has definitely got a kick to it. So, you're going to take it, uh, a little bit of it, though. One hand, one hand. One hand, one hand. Yeah, not just two hands, man. Go like this. See? Do you make it like a... You can make it like a little bit of it. Yeah. It's got a kick to it. Thank you, I'll be alright. Let's go. Mmm. That's better. It's quite as easy as it's consistent, then. How do, you, how do you feel about this soup? Definitely got a kick to it. Yeah. But it's, do you know what? I think they'll grow on me very quickly. I actually do like it. I think it's one of them ones that the kick, once you get past the kick, yeah. wow, it's lovely. <laughs> it's lovely. Yeah. For, for me, definitely. I mean, this, is, this is something different, completely different to what I'm used to. As yeah. I said, it's not English food like Chinese yeah. and pizza. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I do like English food. This is definitely like a mashed potato. Yeah. A little bit harder, I'd say. A little bit harder. Oh, really yeah. nice. Really, really nice. Really nice. I mean, out of 10, I'd probably give this an 8 or a 9. I really would. <laughs> I'd probably replace my mashed potato with this stuff. Yeah. Definitely. The Agusi soup. The Agusi soup. The texture's lovely on it. I've, no, I've never really had spinach, if I'm honest with you. Mm. Spinach is like a new thing to me. Yeah. It's, a, yeah. it's not like it's a new thing to you. It's a new thing to me. But yeah, the, after you get past that initial kick, the hot spice. Yeah. Lovely. You've actually got lots of flavour. Mm -hmm. Texture's lovely as well, and it goes down nice. When you have, I had too much of this first. Yeah. Second time, perfect. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Made a big yeah. difference. That means it's yummy, is it? Yummy. I think that I could quite feel it, happily finish this plate. Definitely. Definitely? Yeah. Look at this side here. If you like it, that's how you do it. You can take more soup if you want. Yeah. John, you see, in my culture, most people are swallowing. I just want to try it. It's too big for you, just take a little bit of it. Okay. That's it. Then you put put the goosey soup, then you swallow it. You know, it's not even no chewing, chew, you know. Like an oyster. Mm. I just got a kick then. I didn't get the kick that time. Yeah, it goes straight. Yeah. It goes straight, yeah. So that's how we hear it. It's a lot smoother. Then it's a lot smoother. All right. Uh, John said he liked this food, and uh, mostly the, the for, for food, it's like a mashed potato, and I uh, really like it. And the egusi soup, see, I've never tried it in life. This is the first time I've tried it. And really, it said it's something it cannot explain. Mm, it's very, very good. Definitely. Definitely. So it's, you can see the way it's even eating this. I, I cannot even believe that this is the first time eating this food. Yeah. I mean, I believe it's, it's, you have been testing it ever since. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the way you eat it, as you just explained, it's completely yeah. different as well to just put it in your mouth and swallow it. It's, not, not what I'm used to. It's out of my it's, comfort zone, I'd say. Yeah, so I'm going to try the, the goat meat. It's a little bit uh, hard, but it's done. It's really cooked. Mm. I used to eat my steaks well done. I wouldn't say that was well done. No. I'd say it's chewy. Lots of flavour to it, though. Lots of yeah. flavour to that. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful. beautiful. Lovely. <laughs> When I test people's food, I see it's good. If it's not good, I'll just say it's not good. But this one, I'm not in your mind. You can you know, I told you, be honest. I really have to be it's honest. I'll tell you what, one thing I've noticed, it's got a lot more flavour. A lot more flavour. You can notice the flavour as you're, as you're eating it. Yeah. Whereas if you get processed food, like oven food, yeah. McDonald's, whatever. Yeah. I can't say McDonald's or whatever. Because when you get made food like that, it loses all that flavour. No, no, definitely. You can definitely notice the difference. So, guys, can you join us as we are eating? When you eat this food, you can save four thousand hours in your body. Really? Yeah. When I eat in the afternoon, I cannot eat other food. When you eat it first time, make it be full, full, full yeah, for longer. Make it full, you know, for still longer, you know? I'm glad I only took a small portion then. Cause <laughs> I've got more to eat. <laughs> Mm. That is lovely, really nice. Let's take a bite of this, then we can go for the next one. Okay, just let me get one mouthful quick now. Don't yeah. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> really nice. I'm not that keen, I'm not a big fan of spicy foods. The first bite was really intense, I could yeah. feel it, but now it's, it's, it's mm. gone. You might take this out. I'm going to put the just this. I'm going to take this one. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my wife would love that. I think yeah. she's, uh, that's definitely yeah. something I would make for my family if I had the ability to do it. So, John, 
Oh, we are trying the fufu and the ikusisu, so we will put this one apart over here. Yeah, other plates. This is your one. This is my one. Thank you. So you can take as many as you want. Yeah. Abby. Thank you. You can take. All right, guys. So we are going to test the, the jollof rice. For me, it's not my first time. Uh, for John, it's the first time of testing it. It's a bit hot and uh, a bit too spicy. Spicy. Yeah. yeah. It's a bit too. No? I'll do. I'll give you a uh, one to ten for how spicy I think it is. <laughs> it doesn't matter. If it's not spicy, you won't like it. No. <laughs> yeah. So John's jollof rice on uh, is quite different from uh, the fufu. The, the fufu is just like. Uh, Traditional food. I believe this one, the jollof rice, is the same, but there are many countries in Africa that eat jollof rice. So you can see it's very beautiful, but I don't know. I know you worry me about the health policy. It's a bit spicy, you know, but it's not it's not as much, you know, just a bit. If it's not spicy, you cannot like it. You cannot, you, you don't like it. I'm a big fan of rice. Yeah. This is lovely. It's lovely. really nice. It's not that spicy. <laughs> you were trying to scare no, me. No, no, I'm not trying to scare you. I'm going to tell you. Well, you say you like it spicy, no? I'm a big not fan of rice. Much. I love rice. And this is. So I've definitely never had anything like this, definitely. Yeah. But consistency, I mean, it's, yeah, it's beautiful. Like I said, it reminds me of like a, a bas basmati rice. Yeah. But with a lot more flavour. Most of it, yeah. A lot more flavour. So, uh, with this. Uh, Good meat too. It's just the same like the other one. This one is cooked different way. We cook the goosey soup with good meat together to bring out yeah, the like, flavor. Like boil, yeah, so boil. Yeah. We have to cook it in another different form. So we don't put it together. When you put it together, sometimes you overdone or sometimes uh, you will not find it in, in inside. You know? so oh, that's fast. It's, best. <laughs> oh. it's, it's not that bad though. It's yeah. going to say it's a six. 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 Is it because it's spicy? It's spicy, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. I know. I know. You had, you it had took to... a while to kick in like that one. It's good it's to be a bit spicy, you know? But yeah. not too much spicy. Yeah, I think otherwise you, you lose the flavour. Yeah, so this is good meat. You can take and test it. Mm. So this one is quite fatty, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's, the fat is good. Yeah, oh, yeah, definitely. But the meat is very tender. Mm. It's got like a bit of a char to it. No. Well. I think I always love meat with the char on it because it gives it uh, a completely different flavour to it. No. I say meat on the bone is a very rare thing for me as well. You like bones? Eh? I never see it really. Uh, it's good to do it with bones, no? I think you get the the stock. The stock inside, yeah. So you see, this Africa food. It's a very lovely food. It is, isn't it? Like, our food is good. That depends where you cook it. You said you never, you never really see this. I've, I've, so if I walk down the high street, there's never any really African food shop, so I can find something like this to eat. Yeah, it's nice to come around and uh, be able to try something like this with you. You see, what meat food is more better than a uh, restaurant food. And I told you several times I don't go to a restaurant to eat food because I make my food at home because I love how we prepare the food. In a restaurant, it's not, it's not, it's not so good. You know, it's, it's not. I can't say it's not good, but if you sit down and cook your own food, you know how tasty it is, that flavor you can, you can really prepare, you know. If you want to try African food, look for a Nigerian family that can cook a real food, you know. Like then secret you recipes see that, yeah, passed down you see through the family. family. <laughs> but if you go to a restaurant, you can, they don't have that time to really cook that food for you because it's many people there, you know. Yeah, not made with love. They yeah, they, they just love. cook it just like that. So, See, you can even cut it in your hand. This bit's not coming off. <laughs> it's fine. Wow. Is this something you eat on a regular basis then, is it? Mm -hmm. For me, I'm really confused that you like this soup. I do, yeah. So it's time for you to rate it. Okay. okay. We'll start with fufu. The fufu. Yeah. The fufu is lovely. Texture, beautiful. It is like a stiff mashed potato out of 10. I'm actually going to give that a 10. That oh. is, is, is stunning, that is. It's something I would have on my plate any day of the week. Yeah. The agusi. Agusi. The agusi. Yeah. The agusi. Definitely got a kick to it. The meat is lovely succulent. Lots of flavour with the spinach as well. Again, so I'm really not used to eating anything like this, but out of 10, I'll give that an 8. Yeah. 
Okay. The rice, I'm going to give that a six because that kick oh, that really <laughs> hit me. It's got a lot of flavour. Yeah. I think the kick took away a bit of that flavour. Yeah. And the spiciness. What it happened that you said, you like the food, no? Yeah. It's not four or three or two. No, no. Yeah, way. I know you are no honest, way. you know. So this is food we always eat in Africa. This is something I'll definitely take home to my partner. Yeah. Unfortunately, I don't have the ability to cook it, so I'm going to have to, <laughs> yeah, to do it's something for me. <laughs> Actually, I think because it's the first time eating this food, no? And I've already come on that time, you got to be used to eat. I can see this flavour lasting with me for the rest of the night, and I think, <laughs> all right, I do think I'm going to be tasting it. Yeah. So that is, yeah. So actually, I think it's not going to be your first time coming. No, definitely not. I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> Which I show, no? <laughs> so, thank you for coming. And uh, I really appreciate your coming. I believe my family over there watching you, they really appreciate your coming. Oh, well, thank and, you. And, and, and I really believe you are the first person that see that here and meet video with us, no? And you said it's not going to be your last No, this is so, an experience I'd like to enjoy again. Yeah. Definitely. So, uh, guys, it's, we come back again. Comment down below and say thanks to John be, be with us here today. I know you're gonna see many times. You're gonna see many times, you know? Yeah, that's right. We'll see that here and beat us and test this food at the first time. I'm not gonna leave this food here. I'm gonna miss some. <laughs> you take it home? Definitely take it home. Definitely take it home. <laughs> so you take it home, then you go I know you're gonna come in and say, ah. Do you know what? I've got what? a feeling that I'm gonna put this in the fridge. My partner's gonna eat you before. <laughs> Right. Yeah. This, yeah, as I said, this is so, so this, it's nice to be able to taste something different. Something yeah. that's not just thrown on a plate, something that's actually something's made with love. And the food is stunning and it's beautiful. And so thank you, definitely thank you for bringing me along today to uh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. That's all right, John. So guys, we are coming to the end of this video. Thank you guys for uh, for watching today and uh please leave a comment on the uh on the section below and uh we look forward to seeing you again. Please subscribe. Hey.